Hey there, folks. Welcome back to On David's Brain. Well, I oh, I showed you my first blind playthrough of Birth uh, Birth by Sleep Fragmentary Passage, and after last time, I went to check in in the extras to see if I can download the new theme. And sure enough, they managed to fix. Uh, they realized, oh wow, we we completely screwed up. So yeah, instead of three dollars, now it's back to free. So yeah, I downloaded the. Uh, 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 key back cover and fragmentary passage themes for free, so nothing to worry about. And now, let's get on to the nitty gritty of this bundle Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance HD. Yeah, though, unfortunately, uh, unlike the PS3, uh, the 3DS version, you can't go and download the uh, complimentary spirits. Or at least, as far as I know, I still have the cards from back in the day, so. Well, if they if they don't let us download them, I can see why, but it still kind of stinks. Yeah, we already know that they're going to be showing the theme anyway, so. And of course, proud mode because, well, I'm awesome like that. So tiles on, yeah, yeah, yeah. Put vibration, yep. So let's see, uh, so let's get started. Hey! Is this how you wanted it? Well, of course it was. Xehanort! You want to fill me in? But that would spoil the surprise. I am. Oh. Hey! Do you remember now, or...? I say Wait. he does. Did you never lose your memory? Uh, that's still kind of up in the air about that. That's not my name. I'm not Xehanort. What? <sighs> My name is Ansem. Welcome to Identity Theft. I'm guessing at that point, uh, uh, Xehanort, yeah. But how far could a raft take us? I'm guessing that was when he installed the MCP to make sure that the system didn't if we get have to. Uh, messed with. We'll think of something else. Riku, a storm's coming. I know. The waves are getting steep. Furl the sail. Right. Uh-oh. Uh, Riku! I'm fine. This definitely didn't happen. What's that? Ah, <laughs> oh, he was right. Those wretched guppies are here. Well, it's about time we settle the score. Uh, ready, Ursula, for, ready for round three? Is this the test? Uh, Come on. No. Uh -huh. You can work it out later. All right. Sorry, dearies, but I won't fall for that trick. Oh, what trick? I honestly have no idea what you're talking about. All right, memento. Might as well. It's been a while. Oh, it's definitely a lot more fluid than on the 3DS. I, I could definitely grant that. Alright, extra attack, yep, yep, yep. And for some reason I can't lock on right now. Yep, HP, yeah. Lock, dodge. Oh, R1, okay. Okay, that's awkward. So you lock on with the R1 button and then switch targets with... Mm. I'll have to fix that later.
All right, there's that taken care of. That's, there's that taken care of. Now to take care of Purple Tentacle's bigger, uglier cousin. You dare toy with me, you insignificant fool! Hey! Fire! Help! Okay, so apparently I can't jump over that. Just don't think about it first, will ya? Prepare to meet Purple Tentacle in hell! Mark of, ma Mark of Mastery. Alright, let's see how we got into this mess. As a Keyblade Master, Xehanort had a gift like few others. But such great minds are often plagued by a single great question. How what much wood could a wood chuck chuck? of the human heart that weakens us or empowers us? Uh, the not answer, my question. He believed would be found in the Keyblade War. Mass genocide, why not? But if the challenges of our past were in fact a map to the light and darkness that battles within us all. Oh, Judas Traveler they would love this guy. Know. So he renounced his duties as master and chose the Seeker's life. I thought you Since gave Erica the job as master. Many a guy oh, no, has clashed with protectors of the light. Keyblade what, wielders like yourself. And mark my words, he will trouble us yet again. I, he still we owes me for those ready. pizzas he sent me. Which is why you, Sora and Riku, are to be tested for the mark of a true Keyblade Master. Because your previous no exploits clearly weren't enough to... Uh, masters already. Again, check the resume. Years of training. Only oh. a true master can teach you the proper way. But I can't be off. Both so. of you are self-taught Keyblade wielders. A pretty good one, that. Feat. 
However, the time has come for you to let go of preconceived notions. Forget what you know about the Keyblade. And so begin your training again with a clean slate. So in our words, what? level reset. But that's a formality, right? I already proved myself. Me and the King and Riku, we can take on anything. Right, Riku? Um... I don't know. I think that in my heart, yeah. darkness still has a hold. Fair point. Walking that path changed me. I'm not sure if Literally. I'm ready to wield a Keyblade. Maybe I do need to be tested. Riku. Then count me in. Put me through the test. Just watch. Me and Riku will pass with flying colors. Okay there, Speedy. Sure, sure. Very well then. Sora and Riku, let your examination begin. Here are your number two pencils. Uh, a glossary that discusses keyblades. Keyblades, keyblade masters. Oh, goody, data log. Uh, Master Xehanort. All right, I'll go through them just to make sure that they match up with what I've seen. Attack the weak spot for massive damage. Yeah, that one was just a freebie, I guess. Okay, familiar locale, unfamiliar, de uh, unfamiliar decor, or attire. Right, that's what I meant. Huh? This is Traverse Town. Hey, what's with my clothes? Must be more of Master Yen Sid's magic. Uh, we'll go with that. Sure. What happened to Riku? Riku! Hello! Riku! Shut it. Thank huh? you. Talk about noise. Ah! <laughs> and yeah, some of them from something I haven't played yet, but Sorry, I've been mean right. to. Yeah, but uh, how do you know that? Good question. Looks like you're not a player. Not, not a good answer. A player? Come what, on, right? keep up. In the game. Don't Players be a player, you know? with the time limit. Mm. And this game, I can't afford to lose. I need my game partner. Okay. I don't know about any game, but can I help? Do you have any star what? chips? Time out. Do you trust every total stranger you meet? He's kind of a mook like that. Sorry. 
You're no good. You're not a player. And my pack's with someone else. Okay, so we can't be partners. Why don't I just help you out as your friend? Oh now boy. we're friends? It's not that easy. I'm gonna friend the ever-loving car out of you. But you could make it easier. Yeah, sounds great. Whatever. Cool. Why haven't Lead I? Away. Why haven't I played the world ends with you yet? Whoa. <laughs> uh, flow motion. Uh, flow motion. Yeah, I'm gonna need to learn these, especially with a different control scheme. Again, the fluidity here is... Mm -hmm. Just like riding a bike. Let's see what we got to work with here. Sport. XP zero off. Good. Let's check the glossary. Keyblades. A key-shaped weapon forged by man during the Age of Fairy Tales. Any other origins have yet to be revealed. All keyblades have one or three natures, light, darkness, or heart. These last two are exceptional, most documented keyblades. These, including Sora and Riku's, are keyblades of light. <laughs> Hold on, there we go. Uh, the heart must be proven before a keyblade will appear in its master's hand. No lock can withstand a keyblade, nor can any non-agent of light. Special keychains allow the Keyblade's performance and appearance to be altered. Oh yes, Keyblades of Heart. Those ones you gotta make yourself, and usually they go through less than ethical means. Keyblade Masters. Guardians of balance between light and darkness. Though they're bequeathing, they choose the next generation of Keyblade wielders, training their bodies and tempering their hearts so that they too might one day become Keyblade Masters. While the word Master might be tossed around, only an existing Keyblade Master... Uh, and can pass the uh, Let's see. While the word master might be tossed around, only an existing Keyblade Master can pass on the title and its associated powers. They often elect the test candidates for the mark of mastery. Among the Keyblade Masters is one true successor who is tasked with protecting a hollow ground known as the Land of Departure. Now I'm currently MIA, but <laughs> whatever. Master Xehanort. Arguably the most powerful Keyblade Master in history, and a staunch advocate for a war where light and darkness are equal. In a thirst for knowledge, he allowed his heart to succumb to darkness. While attempting to reproduce the Keyblade War, he was thwarted. Uh, let's see. In attempting to reproduce the Keyblade War, he was thwarted by three young Keyblade wielders, and his body was seemingly destroyed. However, Keyblade Masters have the power to remove hearts and transfer themselves to other vessels. Master Xehanort has leveraged his power of recombination and clashed with Sora under a number of identities. So yeah, basically Keyblade Masters could do what Dante did in the first film. No, no, not Donald and Christ. <laughs> yeah, so basically, Keyblade Masters are able to do what Dante did in the first Full Metal Alchemist anime, and basically just keep on transferring their bot, uh, transferring their heart and soul into new vessels. Though, in Xehanort's case, it doesn't come along with the degradation that Dante suffered. Let's see. Current model, original model, 
uh, on Kingdom Hearts 2 model. Sora, a boy who wields a keyblade. He's used his power to save the world from crises more than once. Now he's agreed to take on the Mark of Mastery examination uh, in order to re retrieve a new power. Let's see here. Riku, a boy who wields a keyblade. His battles to save the world have often pitted him against the darkness in his own heart. Now he's braving the Mark of Mastery examination to find out if he's still worthy of the Keyblade. The Road Figure A mysterious man whose identity is masked by a brown robe. Cough, and some cough, cough. Sora encountered him in the Destiny Islands right before his first journey began. Riku has seen him as well, though neither of them found out who, uh, for certain who he was. Again, the spoilers, it's Ansem. Yeah, this is him, uh, or, yeah, Xehanort, right. Yeah, this is Xehanort's Heartless. Greg, the human form of Zigbar, one of Organization 13's members. He became a nobody during a certain experiment. The experiment being, let's stab him and see if his heart comes out. <laughs> Man, that sounds insane the more I think about it. Oh yeah, the new enemies in this game. Yeah, the Dream Eaters. The Komori Bat. Uh, these not chilling uh, these not chilling nuisances boast quite the repertoire. Supersonic infusion waves? Yep. Vampire drain attack? Just wonderful. And yeah, they're called nightmares. If we've run into Madoka, Sayaka, Kyoko, Homura, and Mommy and Bebe here, this game might just get a thousand times more awesome. But but we won't. Poop. Anyways, before we track down Neku, we've got some exploring to do! Yay! Ha! Ha -ha! Ha! Ha! <laughs> Imagine if they... Mm. Ha! Ha! I just had an awesome thought. If they had these slow motion abilities and they traveled to the world of Assassin's Creed. Yeah. Ezio yeah. thought he could master the rooftops? Just wait till you see uh, Sora and Riku jumping around there like nothing. Ooh, item commands. Item commands let you use items for sock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ha. Yeah, I know that'll never happen because, you know, different companies, different tones, blah, blah, but ha. I don't care. Ha. Ha. Well, this whole game is basically fanfiction already, so... Well, why not, why not just go completely nuts here? All right, oh, save points. Yep. Reality shift. Yeah, this one is definitely going to be the one I actually need to go and uh, examine. Let's see. If this pink symbol appears over a target, reality shift time. Oh, the triangle and circle button. Oh yeah. You may need to meet different requirements to get the pink reality ship. What they configure. There we go, Type C. Let's see. R1 buttons a uh, toggle lock on, L2 and R2 to uh, change the target. Yeah, perfect.
There we go. Hey, I didn't catch your name. Dream Eaters. That's a weird name. No, That's me. All of them. Thank you. Right. I knew that. Sure you did. Oh, they're too cute. Don't let them surround us. Let's split up. Got it. Oh, uh, it's Neko. Huh? Neku Sakuraba. You asked. Neku Sakuraba. What, you don't have a last name, Sora? That's a mouthful. Just no, Neku. It's really not. <laughs> Come on, Neku. Let's take them. <laughs> right, full motion combat. things with you. They're dream eaters too? Yes yeah. and no. If I'm gonna survive the game, I'm gonna need some extra help. Think you could control them? Sure. I guess. All right. All right. Let's see where these guys came from. If we are ever to strike down Xehanort, we need the individuals King Mickey spoke of in his letter. We must lead them out of sorrow and slumber and back to our world. All right, I'll to go and get so, some comedy tapes and a blow. Seven one. sleeping keyholes must be found and unlocked. Okay, and fine. There's the proper retrieved. way. As you know, every world is walled off from the next, or preventing what... travel between them. That was the case until recently. In the past. You could bridge these gaps because the walls were broken. Yep. Or because you could open special lanes with your keyblades. Guessing that's not the case now. But your new goals, the sleeping keyholes, are harder to reach. Mm. You'll recall in your first journey that you brought many worlds back from the darkness. Yeah. But some never returned completely. And there's they the catch. still sleep, cut off from all outside channels. We Not really need to get a pot of coffee on. Enter. But these sleeping worlds are said to have their own manner of darkness. They are called dream eaters. And there are two kinds. Nightmares, which devour happy dreams. And benevolent spirits, which consume the nightmares. The dream eaters will guide you. Just as the heartless once guided you to the keyhole you seek at the heart of each world. So we got our own spirit animals. The Meow Wow. I've never seen dream pieces when you defeat nightmares. Create a recipe and from scratch. Let's see. To create a spirit using a recipe, you need the materials in advance. Starting from scratch may allow you to create spirits in unexpected ways. Once you've settled on what spirit you want to create, you can sacrifice a tech command to give your creation a stat boost. Your new spirit is part of your family. 
Be sure to give it a meaningful name and watch the TLC. But just like whenever I go and catch a new Pokemon, I just stick to wh whatever name I uh, give it. You know, the Meow Wow. Cat or dog? Boy or girl? Friend or fiend? One thing's for sure, this Dream Eater is adorable. Warning, fire freaks it out. If you use more materials than the recipe requires, create a spirit with a higher level or rank than usual. Levels I get, ranks I never got what that meant. You could also start, uh, right? Maybe it's like a better stats, better defenses. I, I, I honestly don't know. I don't think they ever explain that. Sacrifice one of your commands. Not Spark Dive. That look up and now, Bippity Bobbity Boop! Yay! It's so fluffy! I'll just, yeah, I'll stick with what it is. Meow wow. Is that a loading new spirit? Uh, the spirits will help you in combat, give them lots of TLC to increase their affinity, and you'll be truly, uh, duly rewarded. Hmm. Side spirits are buying with them, earn them link points. You can spend the ability link point to unlock new commands and abilities. Hmm. There we go, you have to double tap, okay. And press the L1 button to bring up the help screen. Let's see, poke, pet. Yeah, I gotta uh, at least uh, poke and pet it around four specific areas to unlock all the areas of the command board. Booster stats or unlock new moves. All well, these are obtained from spirits. Let's see. Stat boosting abilities require that the spirits who obtain them stay in your party. Link critical. If your basic attack and the spirits attack connect at the same time, mm hmm. Alright, there goes the basics.
Meow Wow and Ice Dream Cone. The heart was. Living embodiments of the darkness within our hearts, and therefore the darkness has been in the world since its inception. Although they originate in our hearts, they have no hearts of their own, hence their name. And that they instinctively hunt for hearts and survive and reproduce by stealing them. They have no leaders or hierarchy, least of all the chaotic pure bloods which arise, spon uh, which arise spontaneously. Emblem Heartless, those created artificially by Xehanort's Ansem, behave in much the same way. So yeah, basically, there's no way to get rid of the Heartless. No matter what. The Meow Wow. Kuma Panda. The bigger they are, the harder they claw. It'll take more than a few punches to... Uh, it'll take more than a few punches to the punch to make this lumbering panda see stars. Alright, so, everybody got that? Good. Just like right in the pipe. Ha! Yeah! Ha! 
Okay, so we're in the Sleeping Worlds. Uh, why is Traverse Town here? I mean, Traverse Town de was definitely not asleep when uh, when the whole uh, when the first crisis was over. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I know that Traverse Town was basically like created from the fragments of other worlds, but that doesn't mean that it should have just well gone kaput as soon as you know, as soon as the crisis was resolved. I mean, just. Oh, they split them up into uh, the different menus. <laughs> Perfect. Forecast bonus. Use recipe. Play, I'm just gonna play with Meow Wow here for a little bit. <laughs> yeah, if you poke and prod it around four uh, areas, it should unlock. Let's see. I've completely forgotten which ones they were, though, so this could take a bit of a while, but. Something around about, about its horn. There we go. Change its disposition. That's what I was looking for. Ah, cure spell. Two more points, and then I can unlock the cure spell. Thank you. 
And that's all I'm going to be getting from him for now. The Prickle Mane. These fancy pin cushions take stick and move to a whole new level. Look out when they turn red with rage. The Hebe Rep. Hyperactive and a real handful, these reptiles rock it hard when they roll. Dox your, uh, dox your attacks and then counter. Alright, let's see where's the little spiky hair edge lord. I brought you Sora. We had a bargain. Judas! What's the matter, Neku? He's selling you out, obvious. Uh-oh. Oh, no way! Hey, that wasn't the deal. You All said right. you wouldn't hurt him. Don't, Neku! Ah, They're too dangerous! You can honestly trust the guy looking like that. What? Why am I so... Oh, looks like somebody went and slipped you something. Good night. And as usual, Riku's got to dive down to save you. I got 300 price points. Gold Star. Yay! Huh? Am I in Traverse Town? Well, yes. My clothes have changed. Mm hmm. Sora! Where are you? Well, he was right there, so. I remember we fell overboard after Ursula attacked. And then I think we opened a keyhole. Uh, so, mm -hmm. this must be one of the sleeping worlds. My keyblade. It just sort of popped into my hand when I needed it most. Convenient like that, isn't it? Right. It started. Wow. Huh? Where's your portal? Huh? It oh. takes something special to jump between grounds without one. Who are you? My name is Joshua. Well, me what do you intro. mean, Portal? Are we just skipping past the part where you tell me your name? Rude. Riku. <laughs> Hello there, Riku. Portals are like gateways that link up our worlds. Apparently, the world you and I are standing in right now, well, there are two copies of it. It's been sort of split in half. Portals are what let folks like us cross between them. There can be two of a world? Yes, The world no. is as many things as people need it to be. The concept that we all live in the same world, that's just in our heads. 
surely you knew. Yeah, multiverse and I'll all that jazz. I'll tell you what, Riku. I've got a little errand for you. Sorry. I don't trust you. Instantly smarter than Sora. Aw, <laughs> uh, at least hear me out. I'm looking for a girl named Rhyme. She's the key to the portal. And on the other side, who knows who we'll find? Decade. Maybe even your friend, Sora. Ooh, you little... You know Sora? <laughs> now gotcha. I have your attention. But, unfortunately, I don't know where he is. If he's not in this version of the world, I can only assume he has to be in the other one. Simple logic. Yeah. Okay. You want to find Rhyme? You got it. Let's go. Not much choice. Yeah, they just said where it was. Thank you. Link portals. Approach a pink dot and press the X button to access the link portal. Once accessed, you can face off against or team up with spirits from other worlds. Each portal is marked with a difficulty level, so don't buy off more than you can chew. Or the portal won't disappear if you give up. Uh, you're up and give it another try. Yeah, this is where the 3DS uh, wavelength thing came in. And yeah, Riku's default keyblade, way cooler than Sora's. Let's see, a link portal victories and friendship portals. Well, since we're starting off Riku's little, uh, little traversal through Traverse Town, let's just go and cut it off here for now. This is David Lab with Von David Spring. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and contribute to my Patreon. See ya!